Hello, in this session we will see another question on radius of curvature for parametric curve. So in this case, let us say the question is given like this. We find the radius of the curvature for the curve with x equal to a times of log of sec t plus tan t and y equal to a times of sec t. Now we can clearly see that both a and b are functions of a third variable that is t. Let us say for x equal to x of t and y equal to y of t. So since these are in the parametric form, the radius of curvature can be found by x dash square plus y dash square to the power of 3 by 2 divided by x dash y double dash minus x double dash y dash. So let us start finding the first and second derivative of both x and y with respect to t. x equal to a log sec t plus tan t. So x dash that is differentiation of this with respect to t will actually be a times of 1 by sec t plus tan t and the differentiation of this will be sec t will be sec t tan t plus sec square t. Now we can take this sec common and have tan t plus sec t divided by sec t times of sec t plus tan t. So this thing will get cancelled and we will have x dash as simply a sec t. Again for the second case that is y equal to a sec t this one is going to be direct y dash will be a times of sec t times of tan t. Now the second derivative of x that will be x double dash will be given by a times of sec t times of tan t whereas y double dash since we have found y dash to be let me write it here a sec t times of tan t so y double dash will be given by e times of differentiation of sec t that, that will be sec t tan t times of tan t plus sec t times of differentiation of tan t that will be sec square t so this is e times of sec times of tan square to t. So instead of tan square t we can write sec t square minus 1 plus sec cube t. This is because 1 plus tan square t, t is sec square t. So tan square t will become sec square t minus 1. So this is going to be 2 sec cube t minus of sec t as y double dash. Now coming back to the expression of rho, this is going to be x dash square. So x dash square is a square sec square t plus y dash square that will be a square sec square t tan square t to the power of 3 by 2 divided by x dash that is a sec t times of y double dash that is a times of 2 sec cube t minus sec t and minus of 
वाइड एज दैट इज ए सेक टी टेन टी टाइम्स ऑफ एक्स डबल डैस दैट इज ए सेक टी टेन टी नौ दिस रो यू कैन क्लियरली सी दैट ए स्क्वायर कैन बी टेक इन कॉमन and six square t can also be taken common once you take six square t common we'll be left with 1 plus tan square t so that will be also six square t so let's take the constant outside first so a square to the power of 3 by 2 becomes a cube and this is six square t times of 1 plus tan square t 3 by 2 Divided by, you can clearly see we are getting a square common here. Now, this is sec two sec four t minus sec square t minus sec t tan t sec t tan t. So that should be sec square t. And instead of tan square t, let us write sec square t minus one. As we can take tan square t as sec square t minus one. Now this one plus tan square t will also become sec square t. So overall you'll have sec to the power of four. So this is cutting down this a cube and a. We will have rho equal to sec four t to the power of three by t, three by two. And this is two sec. Four t minus six square t minus six four t and minus of minus plus six square t. So again, these two will get cancelled, and for this also, we will have rho equal to so six four t to the power of three by two will be six six t divided by Sec four t, so that will be simply sec square t. And one of the a was remaining, so that a should also come. So we can see that rho will be a times of sec square t. This is the expression for radius of curvature for the parametric curve. Thank you.